Welcome to channel in this video, we discuss on C programming and BNR Automation Studio with PC based simulation. Open your BNR Automation Studio and create a new project. If you don't have physical PLC, then select PC based simulation. If you want to use PC based simulator, then check to use PC based simulation runtime, then finish. Add C language program in BNR Automation Project. A add object dialog select program, then select new program or existing program click next. Enter name of program and local data type name and add a description of your program click next. Enter the initialization part of the program. Select language as ANSI C and program from drop down menu click to next. Select an option, if you want to assign object to CPU then click finish. Cyclic code executed in a cycle time. Initialization code program execute during startup or initialization of plc.typ file use declarations of custom data types. Dot bar used for declarations of local variable. Open your inserted C program. Below is the cyclic program of BNR Automation. In BNR Automation, C program have predefined layout, which start with a file header section of C program. After file header section, main program section is start. This is main program which executed statement of program. ANSI C program start with preprocessor directives. After preprocessor directives, main program function start. Preprocessor directive in C begin with a hashtag symbol and are used to include header files or define macros. We discuss more about preprocessor directive in C with example. Some another video. Before making a program, declare proper variable and select proper data type. In this program, we find entered value is even or odd. This is a very simple program. Percent sign is modulo operator. If the number is even, then remainder is zero, so value is even. If the value one is not equal to zero, then entered value is odd. Enter value is integer data type, while even and odd values are bool data type. See programming language developed by Dennis Ritchie at Bell Labs. It is generally used for develop a software applications, operating system, device drivers, etc. Nowadays, this programming language also used for develop a PLC program. BNR PLC support ANSI C language for develop a PLC program. After making a program, first build or compile project to check error in program. If any error occurred during compile, remove error, then again build and check program. If everything is fine, transfer your project to simulator. Here, I am using PC based simulation. Select monitoring a program, then add variable for monitoring. Add enter value, even value, and odd value variable for monitoring. If the variable change, then program execute statement. If the enter value is even, then even value variable set to true, and odd value variable set to false, otherwise else statement. If the condition of is statement is false, then else statement executed. In else statement we define, if the value is not even then odd value is set to true, and even value is set to false.
Now we make another program and use call on delay timer function. On delay timer, delay the output of timer. So first declare instance of on delay timer on variable declaration enter name of on delay timer instance and select data type browse for external function select tn. Declare all input and output parameter of on delay timer function and select proper data type start timer and output timer is a bool data type and timer preset and timer elapsed time are time data type. Latest version of ANSI C is C11. ANSI C allows users to call function blocks and access variables from other IEC languages. This standardized version of C language support function prototypes, void pointers, and library functions, string and memory allocation. Add a on delay timer function on program and declare your timer instance name as on delay timer function name. Now declare all input and output parameter of timer in a program we declare start timer to start timer. And for preset value of timer, we declare timer underscore point variable.